I immediately had a red flag and I'm like, whoa, where did that come from? What is this? So I went in, I looked at it and it said something crazy. I honestly believe that this is the start of something big. And I think that Bitcoin is about to have the biggest breakthrough. And this is why. Let me tell you a little story. Yesterday, I, like I normally do, I always go through all my accounts and I just make sure, you know, at least every couple days or so, you know, making sure that everything is all good. Yesterday, whenever I happened to look onto my ledger accounts, I came to find an NFT. And it was strange because I always look on my transaction history to see what's coming in and what's coming out just to make sure that there's nobody being sneaky and just taking a little by little so that way I wouldn't notice. I was looking at my transaction history and I noticed that an NFT had came in on the Polygon network. I immediately had a red flag and I'm like, whoa, where did that come from? What is this? So I went in, I looked at it and it said something crazy. I'm gonna pull it up on the screen and obviously this is probably something that you've never seen before because it's something that I've never seen before so this is why I'm letting you guys know and I'm showing you exactly what's going on and what happened to me that way hopefully you don't get hacked or robbed or anything of that nature we don't want that I didn't go and click on it I didn't research the web I didn't like type in the website and go and do anything Immediately, I'm, I went to Twitter because that's normally where you can get a lot of your news from. I went to Twitter, I typed it in, I didn't find nothing, like no search results, nothing. Then I went to YouTube, I'm like, okay, well maybe it's not on Twitter, maybe people aren't really talking about it like that, but let me go on YouTube, I'm sure someone made a video about this thing, it says 3,000 US dollars, go to YouTube, nothing. But I did happen to see along within my research that they did do some type of giveaway when they released their NFT section on their on their site. It was very similar to what I had gotten and come to find out, obviously the one that I had is a scam because I didn't find it on Twitter, I didn't find it on YouTube, and I sure as heck didn't. Do you know what would happen if you proceeded to do that? This is exactly what they wanted to do. So you would have looked at the website, you would have saw that it said an NFT 3000, you would have thought that maybe, sometimes they do send out NFTs or things like that, airdrops and things like that. So you would have thought it was an airdrop immediately. Boom, that's an airdrop. Okay, I'm gonna go on the website and I'm gonna redeem this. So you see this automatically, you're like thinking, oh wow, this is insane. So you go, you click on it. As soon as you hit your connect wallet in order to you know, do the NFT transfer, that's when they're gonna have full control over your wallet. And at that point, I mean, what can you really do? That's how I'm assuming that this is how it's gonna go. And that's how they wanted, what they wanted me to do. But that didn't happen at all. I didn't allow that to happen. And now I don't know exactly what to do with the NFT, but that's what happened. I don't know if I should send it somewhere else or do whatever. I don't know if they're tracking the history of it or, I don't know. I don't think that it matters as long as I don't trust any website with my wallet don't connect your wallet with anything that you are unfamiliar with you've seen all of the crypto billionaires that have randomly died over the past month or so you've seen all of the exchanges that have went down or went bankrupt or being bailed out by other companies or being tried to because of the hardships that has happened this year you've seen the coins that have been on algorithmic identities and just crashing straight to zero We've seen everything this year and we've seen regulation, we've seen think we've seen Bitcoin in the news, we've seen just crypto in general in the news, we've seen a lot of partnerships. So I personally believe that we are on the brink of something because you're always the closest when it seems the hardest. There's always a bunch of hardships that come right at the brink of you, you know, discovering whatever it is that you're supposed to discover or accomplishing whatever you were supposed to accomplish. So that's what I believe that's happening right now. And as you can see, a lot of that has been happening, especially if you think about next year, how they're doing the Fed pay system in the summer and that's supposed to roll out. And then the CBDC pilot that was happening that I told you guys about um, a few weeks ago or so, I did that video. So go check out that video if you wanna know more about that. But that's been that's happened recently about the stable coin that they wanna produce in the United States. So they're working on that too. 
with that being said, I just want you guys to be aware of what's happening around you. Go follow me on Twitter. I post, I repost a lot of good news that you're gonna see. Or follow me on Instagram. I occasionally put it on my story if it's something like I'm like, whoa, this is crazy. But um, yeah, there's a lot more to come. There's a lot of more news that I need to let you guys know about, but that's just the brink of it. And I think that it's important that you guys open your eyes and be aware of what's going on because I don't think that there's much time before the next thing happened. Now, obviously I'm talking years, like maybe a few years from now, like three years, three to five years. That'll go by in no time. I think that it's important for you guys to diversify and to figure out what you're trying to do right now because time is only ticking. Go ahead and do your thing. Appreciate you all. I'll catch you in the next video.